Hi everyone, welcome to Newegg TV. My name is Paul and today we're going to be doing an overview and some quick benchmark tests on this PlexTor M2 128GB SSD. Now this is the retail box version of the PlexTor M2, so let's take a look at what comes inside the box. Uh, some additional information though real quick, operating system compatibility, you can use Windows, Linux, or Mac operating systems. This also has a 128MB DDR3 cache, which uh, helps with performance and this drive is based on the Marvell 9174 SSD controller. Now apart from the drive itself they have provided you with some software, nice little added value that comes along with the drive. Uh, this is a warranty information sheet. They have provided a very uh, complete manual. You'll notice this is a bound manual with multiple pages so they have instructions here in multiple languages for doing stuff like cloning the drive, manual partitioning, uh, and a little bit more information on using the software that comes on this disc, which is an OEM version of Acronis True Image to help with uh, copying, uh, for instance, an image of your current operating system onto the SSD. So very nice to have that. And that pretty much does it for additional stuff in the box. Let's take a look at the SSD itself, provided that the anti-static bag will let go of it for me. There we go. All right, so some drive information there on the back as well as a serial number. And then here we can see the drive's finish. It has sort of a uh, charcoal color finish. Uh, looks like a bit galvanized. I don't know how to exactly describe that finish on it, but nice simple design. It's gray, it will fit in with most computer components that you might have installed. And uh, then here at the back, you can see the serial ATA data, uh, data and power connectors. And this is compatible with serial ATA revision three, which has a maximum of six gigabits per second uh, throughput rate. So here's our first set of benchmark results. Uh, we started off running Crystal Disk Mark. This is 3.0.1. We ran a 1000 megabyte test. And here we can see our sustained sequential rate speeds, which is uh, just under 370 megabytes per second. Sequential writes just under 200. Uh, as you can see, the rest of the tests there, 512K, 4K, and QDepth32. Down here you can see the uh, more detailed results, and you can see the input-output operations per second. Down there on the 4K random reads, we actually hit just under 20,000, so some very nice results here for the PlexTor M2, 128 gigabyte. We also ran ASSSD, and uh, we have the results right here. On the left are the megabytes per second results, and on the right are the input-output operations per second. So uh, we can see comparable to the Crystal Disk Mark test, we hit 350 megabytes per second reads, uh, just under 190 megabytes per second writes. Access times were uh, just a hair under 0.3 milliseconds for reads and uh, actually 0 0.09 milliseconds for writes, which is really, really just a blink of an eye. Uh, overall score was 311. And then over here on the right side, we can see the uh, uh, related input output operations per second. And we hit 21,022 overall uh, was our best result for the 4K 64 threaded writes. And that pretty much wraps it up for our overview and light benchmarking of the PlexTor M2 128GB SSD. Uh, the model number for this drive is PX-128M2S. Remember to subscribe if you'd like to see more overviews, unboxings, and tutorials to our Newegg TV YouTube channel. I'm Paul with Newegg TV. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.